Pressure Booking System Tutorial. Hi guys, welcome back to another video and in today's video, I'm going to be telling you how you can use Fresher and how you can use it to book your services. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. So over here, as you can see, I'm on their website, Fresha.com. And Fresha is basically a booking website where you can use it to book all of your appointments for your businesses. And right here, you can see there's a real time count going on for appointments booked today. So over here, you can see we have some recommended salons over here that you can go ahead and book with. And over here, we have some recommended trending right now. A lot of people are booking their, you know, sessions over here in this salon. And down below, you can download the Fresha app and you can go ahead and book any salon or studio you want. And over here, you can see for businesses, we have two options. So if you have a business, you can go ahead and, you know, join for free over here. As you can see, it says right here, the number one software is for salon and spas. You can join over here, set up your salon spa, and, you know, you can go ahead and set up your bookings over here. So it is free, but there is a pricing. So over here, the pricing, the only free software, the beauty and wellness professions use. So it's kind of free. All right. Over here, as you can see, free for all, no monthly fee and unlimited usage with no subscription or fee. So it's completely free. There is no plan or anything. You can see you have unlimited appointments, bookings, unlimited team members, unlimited locations, unlimited chats, emails, and notification, unlimited product interview, and unlimited reports and much, much more. And down below, you can go ahead and pick a business type to get started for free. So over here, you have spas, gyms, personal trainers, therapy, tattoo piercings. you got a bunch of different options over here. And down below, you can download the app as well. It's available both on the Android and Apple Store as well. And you can even use it over here on the web so let's get into it so to get started with we'll just pick a type of business that we want to get started with so let's say we have a barber shop that we want to you know go ahead and manage our bookings for because we're getting a lot of people so when you click over here you have the two options to sign up or slash login for everyone this is for book salons and spas near you for businesses here you will be able to manage and grow your business if you are looking for this option just simply click over here in this video we're going to be managing our business and once you've done that just sign up so to sign up all you got to do is enter in your email address or you can continue with your facebook account google or apple store so just simply click on whatever options you like and sign up and over here you can see you have to enter in your first name your last name email address phone and you should be good to go over here you can upload your own you know picture as well currently this is just an o for my google account so i'm going to fill this out and catch you guys in a second and it's as simple as that. After that, you got to set up your account. So they're going to ask you some questions like, what's your business name? What's it about? So over here, you can add your business name. If you have a website, you can add it over here as well. So let's go ahead and add the name of our, you know, shop or our business. And then we'll click on continue. And what service do you offer? So here you can go ahead and add services. So we have barbers, right? Barbering, massaging. We give a little bit of this a little bit of that but haircuts and styling uh facials and skin cares uh you can add more stuff to it but i think for now this looks good and then we'll click on continue and over here what is the size of your team so if it's just you you can go ahead and do this if it's two to five people and we'll go ahead and click over here we'll add wendy as an example employee so you can see how the system works that's great we'll select that and click on continue and where is your business located? Just add your option right here. I don't have a business address, mobile services only. So I'll just select that if you want to. If you want, you can go ahead and add that. I think for now, we'll just skip that for now. Click on continue. And which software are you using currently? So over here, you have a bunch of different options to choose from. If not, just simply click on, I'm not using any software and then click on continue. How did you hear about them? Recommended by a friend or we'll just go with social media. Click on done. And now your business is set up, as you can see right here. And now we can go ahead and set up our bookings, our calendars, and manage our business. So here you can see you have your account. Here you can set up your account. So for example, uh, you can see we've already done with 50% of all the tasks, right? We got to complete five tasks in order to complete our pressure account. So over here, we have to add business address, add your business website, set up your service list set up your team members and set your working hours over here down below there are some things to try out like create your first appointment in the calendar check out the appointments to unlock reports and simplify your tasks import your clients and instantly book your you know regulars with the click of a button and you can keep in touch with the automatic appointment notifications thanks to you notifications which is going to be a thank you message and more so it's a pretty cool setup over here this is the calendar let's go ahead and close this up for now we can go ahead and open this up later this is wendy this is one of the employees that you know fresha added over here 
I believe, or is it one of our clients? I'm not sure, but we'll see. Over here on the left-hand side, we have some options. So this is an employee. Sorry about that. I thought this was client. No, this is not a client. This is a team member over here. This is one of the people that works for us. So over here on the left-hand side, we have home, calendar. We have sales, clients, list. It's going to be over here. Here's going to be the catalog. All the services that you provide are going to be over here. We've got online booking, marketing, payment system, and team members are going to be over here. we got reports and other add-ons as well. So let's go ahead and check add-ons so that we can see what else we can add. So in the integrations or add-ons there's not a whole lot there's just the basic stuff that you would need like google reserves right you can catch your bookings over here through google maps and google searches facebook and instagram bookings are going to be available as well metapixel and google analytics so then you can keep a track of your websites or your stores analytics so yeah pretty cool and this is the home page here you can see all of your data your recent sales the appointments over here top services top members and many many more here is going to be the news the latest news is over here and over here is going to be some notifications that you currently get so we can see we've got a new appointment over here six minutes ago this is like for demo purposes so that we can see how it works so if an appointment comes over here like at 10 p.m today at beer trim for jack booked with wendy so if you click over here we can see uh, how it would look like here this is the person jack doe add pronouns that's that is the data that currently we have here is the ad trim service all right here we can add services and here we can go ahead and check them out you know and here you can see it's booked currently confirmed started start now no show cancel we can do all of that from there as well which is pretty cool so let's go ahead and you know click on this checklist and see what we got so first let's go ahead and add the business address click on start you can go ahead and add the business address over here you can add billing details for client sales you can add the company name address and notes if you want and i don't have a business as of right now we'll go ahead and click on save and here you need to add the billing address for your store so over here you gotta add that and then you'll be good to go so after you've added that as you can see it'll give you a check mark and now you can add your business website if you have it and then you can go ahead and set up your service list so let's go ahead and do that so here is the service list as you can see on the left hand side underneath catalog we can find it right here service menu these are all the services that we offer barbering haircut beard trimming haircut and beard trimming right we have massage over here classic massage we can add other stuff over here facial and skin care as well so these are all five categories right here in this category we have barbering we have three options for barbering massage is going to be one over here facial and as well if you want you can add more categories over here you can add the description of it as well and over here if you click on add you can add a single service package or category entirely so if you click on single service here is the basic details uh, basic details are going to be over here so what is the service name the service type if you click on this little drop down menu over here like arrow it's going to drop down this entire category of these services that are currently we offer so we've got scalp micro pigmentation scar removal skincare moroccan bath i think a lot of people offer these kind of services but we should keep things simple right but yeah if you wanted to add a service you can add it give it a name add the service type menu category is going to be over here add the description and down below you can go ahead and pricing and duration and fixed price from free whatever it is that you want you can do that you can add different variation of a service as well and if you want you can add extra time if you want that if we check out the advanced option we can see we have the advanced option you know location and team members duration and who is going to be able to do it for what price you know everyone has a different price if you want to go ahead and do that you can go ahead and do that over there as well but yeah that's how you can add different services into your barber setup so as you can see we've done that already let's go ahead and take a look at our team members we'll go ahead and add another team member as well i feel like wendy might have trouble you know so let's go ahead and add stuff to it so over here we can add the profile picture but yeah we can add the name i'm going to add the name over here and there we go we have added the team member just fill those details out and we should be good to go as you can see currently the invitation is pending but we can go ahead and leave it at that for now over here no reviews right people can go ahead and give us reviews if you want so yeah and over here we have schedule shifts so if you want you can go ahead and schedule shifts. so over here you can see jack doe has 9 a.m to 7 p.m and on a tuesday 9 to 7 9 to 7 all the way up to the weekends and in the weekends it's gonna start an hour late and finish two hours early so 10 to 5 same thing with other ones as well so you can add different shift over here you know depends on you how much room you have within your store within your salon you know all the capacities and stuff like that 
And yeah, you can go ahead and change it anytime. Over here, you can see we have this plus icon underneath them and you can add shift, add regular shift or add a time off if you want to. Depends on you. Over here, you can add the time off. New teammates are going to be added over here. And yeah, let's go ahead and add a new teammate. I think nah, we added Jack. That's good. That's good. So now that we know how to add teammates, we, let's go ahead and add some clients. Over here in client section, you can add your clients. We already have some example clients that Fresha has added into us so that we can go ahead and learn how it works and set up our business in catalogs of course we already know how to we can add service we can also add memberships as well so here you can go ahead and add memberships which is free to use which i think is pretty cool one of the cool things about fresha is that it's completely free you don't have to worry about any you know hidden fees or you know any hidden plans or anything like that so to manage multiple sessions with memberships you can just simply go ahead and start now over here you can go ahead and name it like a weekly membership monthly membership right in it you can add description like hey in this monthly membership you can have like five to six session whenever you want and in the weekly one you can have one session whenever you want and you'll always be the priority or something like that you know you can add whatever you want and over here you can see you have the limited session numbers as i said before you can add like a number of five sessions three sessions whatever valid for one month over here you can add the price for it tax rate is going to be over here so if you want you can add no tax whatever you want and color you can go ahead and add customizations to differentiate different plans or different you know memberships for different people and terms and conditions are going to be down below and once that's done just simply click on create and you should be good to go and people can go ahead and you know subscribe to the membership whether it's monthly weekly you know depends on you and over here you also have the product section here you can go ahead and manage your inventory with fresher products so let's say you have your own pretty successful barbershop and now you're starting your own line of products like shampoos conditioners and facial creams and stuff like that you can go ahead and add that product list over here and you can click on start now it's free of course so order over here you can see the product name product barcode measurements are going to be over here short description product description you can select the category over here price and everything which i think is pretty cool this is one of the cool things about pressure is that it's a complete system for absolutely free which i think is really really great a lot of people should use it and it works in almost all the countries and over here we also have other options like inventory here we have these stock takes here we can track and record our product stocks we can manage them you know we can see how much we have in stocks and over here we have stock order there's currently no products created yet but yeah we can go ahead and do that let's go ahead and create a product first all right so we're going to click on products and we're going to create a shampoo right product name is going to be zen shampoo we're going to add a picture over here and it's uploading right here and this is going to be the main photo it looks good over here we can add the product barcode if we have one over here we can add a, the size of it it's going to be milliliters over here let's say this like a 500 milliliter bottle so we'll add 500 milliliters short description of the product whatever category you want to add and then over here we can add categories as well so let's go ahead and add it this is going to be the shampoo click on save and we're going to add the price let's say it's like ten dollars and retail price over here sorry this is going to be the supply price so it's like let's say four dollars the retail price is going to be ten dollars maybe even fifteen dollars and over here we have default tax we'll add no tax all right and yeah after that we should be good to go we can add stocks let's say we have currently 50 in stocks low stock is going to be let's say 10 and reorder quantity is going to be 50 and then we're going to click on save so now we should be good to go so now we've got a product if we go into stack orders over here we can see we have currently no suppliers created we can go ahead and create a supplier over here and we can add our own supplier for this one of course you're going to have to create your own options over here for them but yeah it's going to be different for everyone and this is for the catalog option then we have online bookings here you will be able to see all the bookings right here so currently we have marketplace profiles over here so here you can go ahead and create a profile on google maps like as you can see over here in the right hand side we have reserve with google here you can go ahead and add them as well like you can go ahead and add uh, google reserves and over here you have facebook and link builder as well so you can go ahead and get started with over there it's actually pretty cool so to get started with the marketplace profile click on start now and over here this is the overview free so you can see online booking no monthly free subscription so then click on next add your business information over here add the phone number the location the service is available and then click on next step 
right? Currently, we don't have a description, but you can add a description of the barbershop for your own business. So we'll just say this is a barbershop, just as an example, but we need 200 characters. So I'll just go ahead and add like a proper description now and then add your location over here. Just simply add the address and you should be good to go. And over here, if you click on um, options, we can save and exit at any time. So we'll go ahead and add the address as well. So over here, I think this should be good to go. E 28th street, right? I'm not sure street number, or we could just say E 28. And we'll just add whatever you know comes up over here and we should be good to go then click on next and you can add your own opening hours click on next and you can add like a business photo of your you know shop and once you've uploaded your image you everything looks good just simply click on publish and there we go after that this is going to be the client link here people can go ahead and book with your online store so let's go ahead and take a look right click on got it go ahead and paste the link over here let's go ahead and see how it looks like so here is the barbershop book an appointment group appointment right if you click on book appointment here people can see all of our services that we offer our total is going to be over here and we can go ahead and easily book it which i think is pretty cool so that's pretty cool but yeah let's go back over here and here we've already done that next we have marketing here you can go ahead and promote your fresher website or store so here you have 24 upcoming appointment reminders, right? Reminders are going to be over here. Uh, you got appointment updates over here. Waiting list currently. There we go. Wait list. Uh, it kept moving over to increase booking. But yeah, this is going to be your wait list here. You can go ahead and add whatever you want. And then we have celebrate milestones down below, which I think is pretty cool. You're going to have your messages history on the left hand side, promotions and deals uh, over here. You can go ahead and create a deal currently or start a promotion. Smart pricing is going to be over here. And then down below, you're going to have reviews. So you can go ahead and boost your reputation by just adding reviews from your client. And then here is your payment settings. Here you can go ahead and add payments. So over here, power your business with the FreshUp payment app. Sorry, it's not a payment app. It's a payment machine. You can get paid by clients. I don't see an option to get it though. It's coming soon right here. So I guess that's that. And then now below, of course, you have your team members and then you have your reports. And here, as you can see, we have reports and analytics. You can see all the performances of your store. Uh, you know, you can see online present dashboard, online performance. You've got sales over here. Finance is going to be over here. Appointments, team, clients, everything. You can go ahead and track everything and all the analytics are going to be over here. Then you have the settings option as well, where you can go ahead and click on it and, you know, add some settings so you've got teams forms over here you can configure templates for client forms payment options are going to be over here sales scheduling and business setup as well so if you click on it i believe we've already done that but you can go ahead and add external links over here with your instagram facebook website and x over here which is going to be twitter locations are going to be over here uh, client sources are going to be over here yeah it's pretty cool and also you've got online presence over here so yeah we've already i think went through all of this but yeah so these were all the things that you needed to know about Fresh Up. I'm sure there's plenty more, but you can go ahead and mess around with it. But these are all the currently main things that we needed to know about. But yeah, this is how you do it. This is how you can set up and use Fresh Up. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment sections down below. And I'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible. So having said that, thank you for watching. And until next time, take care and goodbye.